Hello. Let's see what decisions you'll make today. What's up? How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to some more Detroit Becoming Human. Uh, it's, it's been a little bit. It's been a little bit, but it's okay. I'm trying to finish this game, at least this game. Uh, but now I'm starting a, a lot more games than I should before I'm finishing the other ones, which is pretty a, probably a bad idea. But uh, I'm gonna finish one at a time. Maybe two, if I have what's have what have what it takes. A little, a little tired, but it's okay. Uh, kind of forgot where I was. Remember, I shot her. I'm sorry again. Oh yeah, um, I forgot his name. I'm going to see my owner's grave. Uh, you always said that living was about making choices. So what if I chose to defend myself against Leo? Maybe you could still be alive. Maybe a lot of things could have been different. Unless all of this was just meant to happen. You taught me everything I know, but you didn't prepare me for this, Carl. I believe we would win because our cause was just, and I can see now that... Does he hate him? I was wrong. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? I miss you, Carl. <laughs> I miss you so much. I'm trying to like pick the right choices, but I'm not sure what to do. Like he's not p picking the obvious choices. Yep. It's me. I'm coming for you. Bloody it. Oh, this dude again. The previous Connor failed its mission. You're going to replace it. You know what you have to do, don't you? Destroy the leader of the Deviants. Go, Connor. Don't disappoint me. Uh... Okay. I didn't pick any choices that time why at a church or something it's pretty cool with all the blue LEDs everywhere oh, by the way I have a new setup going on so hopefully it works better They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. Exterminate. I'm sorry. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. What's your system status? I'm OK. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. 
You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. I'm with you, Marcus. Wherever you go, I go. Sweet. So, I move, you move, just like that. I like her voice. It's kind of cute. So, if it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. I don't you know. I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Nice. So that's. All I'm doing is like confirming people who's on my side. Anybody else? I don't I don't think you won't be on my side. Our people are counting on you, Marcus. Oh, sweet. You're the only one who can lead us. I wasn't too sure if he was gonna be on my side. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Oh, wow. I know, I know you're all angry, and I know you want to fight back, but I assure you violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them peacefully that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me?
wait, did I really need? No, no. All right. All right. I don't think I really needed that. Marcus. Uh, At 6 a.m. Uh, this morning, a national curfew was declared. Caption. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized, and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks What about Connor, huh? The situation is under control. Madam President! Not a convoy of medical cobalt is reported missing. Army weapon stores are also said to have been robbed. Can you confirm these reports? I have no information on that at this time. Madam President! Madam President, what's gonna happen to CyberLife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with CyberLife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything else until we've dealt with the android question. Please. Madam President! Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Mm. Next question, please. Please? What a... Please? Please? Madam President, public opinion seems to be particularly hostile to the deviants because of their violent behavior. Can you give us your perspective on that? The deviants have proved to be very violent so far. They have demonstrated that they are a menace to society, and I have every intention of eliminating them. Thank hey, you. Jay that will be all. Well, last last question, last question, last question, I shouldn't have done anything. I should just see what would happen. <coughs> Forward! I'm scared. I, I don't want to go. There's no choice, Alice. Next! No, Cara. I, I can't. You have to go through the gate now. You first! Mm. 
Wait, just give her a minute. She's just a little girl. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going. They don't give a care. She's just a, I don't know. Come don't know on, if it's your turn. Or Android anymore. I'm not doing anything. Do you want to kill me? Hey, I'm gonna go just in case he does. He seems pissed, so I'm gonna go. He hit me like five times or two, three, I don't know. So I'm just gonna go ahead. Wait, recycle? Nope. I'm. See ya. No, I'm gonna go, okay. Hurry up, get in. Activate your skin. Hurry up! Please, Kara, don't... We have to. Strip off, put your clothes in the dumpster. Crash test dummies. I know this is supposed to be a touchy. Come game, on, but... this way. Yeah. Get a move on. Okay. You, take this one of a jump. No, no, please, I beg you. I gave you an order. Obey now. I beg you, please don't kill me. and make it snappy. Right away, sir. Forward! Come on, get moving! You, over there! No, wait, we're together! Over there, I said! We're coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Madam President? Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. <laughs>
magazines around. Here we are, the moment of truth. Our people have risen up to claim their freedom. If you want to stop us, you'll have to kill us. This is genocide. You're killing millions of us. We demand the immediate liberation of all androids detained in camps. We're not leaving until you let our people go. <laughs> oh, let my people go. We're all gonna die. Oh! Are you gonna open fire on unarmed protesters? Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Shouldn't do this, Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. If you're gonna kill a man who wants to be free, that is my business. It's not a man. It's a machine. I knew he was That's what that. I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. Deviant's blood may be a different color than mine. But they're alive. I have a mission to accomplish, Hank. It's best if you just stay out of this. Deviants are a threat to humans, Hank. They're the reason this country's on the brink of civil war. They have to be stopped. We're in oh, this mess are. because we refuse to listen to deviants. Humanity never learns from its mistakes, Connor. 
This time it could be different. Step away from the ledge. I know what happened to your son, Hank. It Did wasn't your fault. Kill him? A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Little Cole had just turned six. Shut up! Don't you talk about my son! He needed emergency surgery. But no human was available to do it, so an android had to take care of him. Poor Cole didn't make it. An android killed your son, Hank, and now you want to save them? No. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. All this time, I blamed androids for what happened, but it was the human's fault. Him in this fucked up world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Tag. Just a machine. You're a machine, Connor. Just a machine. The snow is soft. Alice! I get out of here. Okay, oh, that is I want to get out. <laughs> from the master's house. So you were captured too? The humans found us. They said we were monsters. They killed most of us. They put the others in trucks and brought us here. Why is her blood red though? Should it be blue? Why have they have gathered us all together like this? What are they going to do? Listen. Do you hear that? That's the sound of our people dying. The little girl I was with. Have you seen her? Again, why is her blood blue or red? It should be blue. Should 
Should we like go Daisy on these people? Jerry? Kara. So they captured you too. They came to take all the Jerry's. They separated us. But it's all gonna work out, isn't it? Do you know where Alice is? Alice? The little one? We know, y yes. We think we saw her. Carl, if we can help in any way, just ask. We have to save the little one. Alice, do you know where she is? You stay here. We come back soon. Do I remember him? I don't think I remember him. Car, Alice! Are you okay? Are you hurt? I don't like this place. We have to get out of here. Come on, move along. Come on, you no. too. Wait a minute. Leave her alone! Leave her alone! Car! The, like stress meter is come on this way get moving faster We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Now this is somebody's car. Hey, help me! That should do it. We all know that's not gonna stop them. Yeah, no doubt. Just hope it buys us some time. I know it was not an easy decision to make, but I'm sure we're doing the right thing. Marcus, we found what you asked for. You guys? Uh, There's some journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on.
barricaded the soldiers. to like do this are you all right yeah, you. they shot into the crowd many of us were killed it could have been me I'm scared I I don't want to shut down we're here because we never want to feel that fear again because we're more than what they say that's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. Here we go. So I guess that sensor, like, depends on uh, what he's feeling, I guess. Oh, well, that's the button. Here. Oh, duh. This is before when I'm walking by it. And again, we're androids. We don't feel cold, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, I don't know. Hey, you. You okay? This won't hold on for long, but. Are you drunk? I guess it's better than nothing. They're getting into position. If they attack, no one will survive. Did I make the right choices? Maybe we could have avoided all of this. You're the hope of our people. Maybe. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I'm unarmed, Marcus. I just want to talk. I need to hear what he has to say. All right. What fair if they enough. kill you? It's up to you. And that's a chance I'll have to take. Few minutes, the troops will be ordered to charge. 
none of you will survive. I know It'll all be over. You can avoid that, Marcus. Yeah, what do you mean? You know. Surrender. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. You'll be detained, but... None of you will be destroyed. What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. I'm not afraid to die. If I have to give my life for what I believe in, then I won't have lived in vain. You could be free, Marcus. I need to be free. To live among the humans. You could have what you've always dreamed of. Meet all my friends. The lives of your people. Freedom for you. All you have to do is say the word. I'd rather die here than betray my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. Thanks. Good talking to you, man. Good talking. <sighs> He's gonna get shot. He's gonna get shot. What happened, Marcus? What did he say? The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. Dang. Okay. I am going to go ahead and end it here, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy it. And until next time, I will see you in the next video.